Hello everybody. Um, just came in to remind everybody about what's going on tomorrow. Valentine's Day. We're gonna have a campfire. And if and if you want, bring desserts. A lot of people are bringing desserts just to share, to sit around the fire. And then update you on what's been going on around here. Okay. A lot of people have been leaving. Well, not a whole lot around here. There's some. Finally got rid of Dan's friends. Just kidding, guys. It's noisier when Dan's friends are around. <laughs> but yeah, some over there. A few, actually, right behind this bush. They're gone. A couple of people down further. I guess. Some down here, but some have gone and others have returned. So let me not put you right in the sun. Camp is, well, it's bare out here because we've had a lot of rain. So I've, I've kept the chairs mostly in the tent. I'm going to keep bringing them out. Actually, I was going to do that today, but I'm putting it off. I need a little lazy. Got to get my water jugs filled. So, do you want to bring um, desserts tomorrow? We've got firewood ready for the fire tomorrow night. Anytime after 5, 5 o'clock on is good. You don't have to bring a dessert. If you want to just come for the campfire, that's fine too. None of us mind. Um, some things that have gone on. Let's see. We had a um, birthday party. Not really a big party. Just a few of us got together for Ron's birthday. I think I've got a little clip. I'll put it at the end. And then I went over to a friend of Shutterbugs, Teresa. She was having like a pajama party, make your own pizza. So we went over there, enjoyed my time over there. Thank you, Teresa. And then we've had some sad things happen around here. Um, my friend George, he got life lighted out, you know, over a month and a half ago. Well, yesterday he called me up in the morning Said he was having a panic attack so i went over there saw him on george i think i'm gonna call 911. and i just said yes and i called 911. they came and got him um took him to the helipad helicopter took him up to uh, by, uh, by the phoenix area and then i haven't heard from him since then but then Today, another guy that has been camping around here, he got life lighted out again, or today, he got life lighted out today, not again, just today. So one yesterday and one today. I hope both of them are doing well. I'm not gonna say what's wrong with them. It's their business, but they're not doing too well. I wish they were doing better. I was hoping to get George's strength up, you know, bring him one or two meals a day. But I guess he didn't need just that. He needed more. So George and Steve, please get better and come back. So I think that might be enough firewood. We've had to keep it covered, most of it covered anyways, because we've been having a lot of rain around here. And the weather looks like it's gonna be in the 70s, low to mid 70s in the next week or two. So that's great. Yeah, it's been kind of quiet. 
people have been staying in the rigs, you know, of course, because of the rain and the wind. But mine held up pretty good. Even the screen tent in the back didn't fly away. I guess I'm learning how to keep everything tied down. Getting pretty good at it. Last year I lost some poles bent on me with the canopy. Nothing's been damaged this year. Alright. Tomorrow night, Valentine's Day, dessert. Bring a chair. Bring your drinks. I'm going to open up my bin that has all the booze in it. I don't have mixes or anything, but I'll share my if you want to come. All right. Thank you, everybody. Bye-bye. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Ron. <laughs> oh, Kimmy's almost there. <laughs> oh, uh oh, 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 <laughs> oh wow!